live from across Northern California, this is Good Day. And I'm Lily Sarthi's hanging out at the bowling alley, T. I'm going to tell you about a local high school student has come up with a fantastic idea. How about offering free bowling clinics for our local youth? Yeah, I'm going to introduce you to this high schooler. That's coming up. He's hanging out at the bowling alley this morning. Oh, let's see. Let's see how she does it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, she got one. You got one. She got one. We are live this morning in Rockland. You guys, this is so cool. And you know, I will take any opportunity to brag about my fellow St. Francis High School trophies, mm -hmm. right? Let me introduce you. I've got one right here. This is Ashley. You are going into what year at St. Francis? I'm going to my senior year. See? year and she has come up with a program it is called bowl for soul where you offer bowling clinics for local kids i love this tell me the story behind it yeah so i did a lot of sports when i was younger and bowling was the one that stuck with me and so i wanted to teach some kids about it because i feel like it's a very misunderstood sport because people just think it's a party activity but it actually is a very unique and inclusive sport yeah so you've been offering these clinics for free for to, to local kids. These are all kids, my friends, that have been part of these clinics. So what is it that you teach them over the several week session? So we have a couple concepts that we've been doing. Each week we introduce a new concept, but the main thing we've been trying to do is get them to take four steps and then throw the ball. Yeah. And what we want them to do is when they throw the ball, we want them to release their arm and pull it back to their shoulder. So touching their shoulder and bending their knee. Because I wish I had a pen so I could write this down. Because yeah. I feel like that would even help my game. Yeah, it's the best way to be stable and just have a good shot. That's the basics. No, you gotta be stable, Elisa. This is so incredible in that you, right, I, I know, I'm not exactly stable, <laughs> but this is so incredible. What's even more incredible, my friends, I'm gonna bring in Stacy here with the Dragon Kim Foundation. This is actually one of a number of different projects that this foundation is actually helping support. Let's talk a little bit about that foundation. Yeah, so the foundation started about seven years ago to, and it started as a music project program down in Santa Ana, California, yeah. and we've been able to grow it to about 35 projects this year with 70 high schoolers that are doing these, these projects, and the projects range anywhere from this bowling project yeah. that Ashley has been doing. We have coding. We have some kids teaching coding. They could be a dance program, etc. And the foundation helps support and finance these passion projects. Absolutely. We give them $5,000 over the summer to put on these projects so they learn leadership skills, yeah. uh, business skills, etc. And at the end of the program, they, we do a contest, sort of a dragon challenge, <laughs> where the top three present, and we give the top program another $5,000 to continue the program. That is, is so incredible. What an opportunity for high school. And you know what? You, you know, Ashley was part of this last round, but you're already in a few months going to be accepting applications for a new one. That's right. So starting in November, we'll start another round. We usually have over 100, 100 projects actually present, and then we pick a, a subset of those to, to run with, with the program. Fantastic. All right. Is there still an opportunity, Ashley, for local kids to be part of your clinic? So we are trying to get to the top three to make it to Dragon Challenge. If we get there, we will get five thousand more dollars to run the project so hopefully if everyone votes for us we will get to the top three okay. and we will get the five thousand dollars i have an idea i bet we might convince them if you show us your bowling skills oh. she's she's got the glove on all right go ahead all right she competes as well locally on top of all her academics this uh, all right oh, oh the, let, maybe we can borrow that one okay all right here she goes my friends she's got a sparkly ball, ball too Look at that form. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, oh! Yes! Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done! All right, what local team are you on? Where, where can we cheer you on? Oh, well, I'm just here at Fireside, like, competing yeah. in league. I mean, Fireside. This is AMF Rockland. Yeah. And I also go to Fireside and Citrus Heights. So those are the two places. Yeah, you compete. All right, all right, What's my your friends. average? Ashley, St. Francis, shoot. What's your average, Miss Tina McCool wants to know? It's like 170 right now, but we're working nice. on getting it higher. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. All right. Congratulations. Does she have a fingertip so ball? Much, Stacey. Do you have a fingertip ball? Yes, I do. That one show is John. one of four balls that I have right now. And it's 15 pounds. And it's 15 oh, wow. pounds. Okay, show John this the fingertip. Right it's a, it's a fingertip. Okay, tell finger her to hold tip. it. Is it this tell one? Tell her to hold yeah. it. 
Okay. So we can get a close up on the fingertip. So, See? Oh, oh, she has the insert. Oh, fingertip. Okay. Yeah. See? So it only goes to your You're first. being educated on what a finger you gotta put, oh. you got to put your thumb in first and then these fingers. Yeah. So I mean, it doesn't really work with the house ball, but this is what you're supposed to be doing. The house yeah. ball's I, I have literally learned so much about bowling in the last yeah. five minutes. Right? <laughs> it's pretty cool. I love it. Congratulations to you. So awesome. And love what she's doing with our community. Yay. All right. I'll send it back over to you. I love that. I love that. Thanks, who? She's helping other kids. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah.